Oh god, people are actually showing up. Oh shit! Put away the water! Put away the phone! Everything! Ah! <laughs> Fix the microphone! What are you doing? Okay.
I wasn't panicking. What do you mean? <clears throat> non possumus Ionic! Hello. Nice to see you. Welcome to more weird ass gaming with Commander Useless. Haha. <laughs> uh, I thought my fan was off. And it was, but I wanted to be on. Guess it's uh, it's not hot, but it is kind of humid. I should be able to see the chat from before I showed up. Um, I'm pretty sure all it is is a bunch of Shen parties and Shui Danik and ex Scotty Pew Pew. Also, the mods only rave. Fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> Eight thirty-five. I was still setting things up at that point. So I have a pretty decent game. Well, no, I'm lying. It's not <laughs> I can't even keep that lie up for long. It's another first-person horror game, but this one is more like Resident Evil, uh, meaning that it's not so much a text adventure as it is a poorly voice-acted, poorly animated, poorly controlled first-person Resident Evil. Well, that's fun. Now, I did a very brief test run just to make sure it works. And, uh, I gotta say... I had some slight audio issues. It, it makes this crackling noise every now and again. And I can't tell why. Now, this game is not English patched. It is English by default. Uh, so we'll have all the glorious voice acting in English. Hello, blah blah. Don't worry about the missing the announcement. I made it really late because I was having dinner until like 10 minutes past 8 anyway. Deep fried food tends to uh, require some extra time before getting away from the table. <laughs> Otherwise, you're gonna fall into the fetal position on the way up the stairs. Maybe that's just me. That's pretty stuffed. <laughs> Poor man's Resident Evil, pretty much. It even kind of starts with a wow, what a mansion sort of thing. Not quite, but close enough. If the audio stuttering gets really bad, I'll figure something out, but it shouldn't be too bad. Anyways, I got a big pitcher of water. And I got my fan on. I got my fans watching. Haha. <laughs> it's weird. There's clearly a bunch of you here, but it says zero viewers. Which is why I was panicking. Like, where is everybody? Ah! But when I look at the chat list, I see clearly at least 10 people here. So, I don't know. They're lying to me, I guess. Interesting, interestingly, the chat is not showing blah blah at all. Just Amic and non -possumous. I think Twitch is a little bit broken at the moment. And you know, I can't just make like deep fried food like I threw something in the in the hot oil and called it good. No, I had to steam my own rice, I had to like boil my own sweet and sour sauce. I had to make my own coleslaw. Eh, I'm finicky like that. Anyways, yeah, I would have had a better background screen here with a better picture, and I would have played some horror music, but eh, I didn't really feel like wasting all that time to set that up because I've been waiting long enough. So, after dinner, I do 400 push ups and 800 sit ups, and then I go for a 65 kilometer run. Do you throw up in between of that at all? <laughs> Is that part of the schedule? Um, one of my siblings, and I, I swear to you this is this is true. Um, when he when he visited recently, this is kind of personal. So I'm not gonna say his name or anything, but he 
he's a strange man, let's say. He, he, okay, so he woke up at like four. He went for a, I think, 20 kilometer run. Yeah, 20 kilometer run. Came back, had coffee. And a shower, of course. Didn't eat anything until like lunchtime. And at lunchtime, he ate like a ton of food. I, I can't even like begin to describe it, but it was a lot. Enough music. Um, <laughs> and then for dinner, uh, he bought fast food. He bought a lot of fast food. In fact, I counted how much he ate. And remember, this is not how much he bought. This is just how much he ate. One Big Mac. Four cheeseburgers. One big set of fries. One big drink. One milkshake. One ice cream. Four fried apple pies. And a donut. He bought about twice as much. He's actually skinny. If you can believe that. <laughs> yeah, no, we were in awe. Um, in, in, in a bad kind of way. <laughs> it was kind of terrifying, honestly. I was really scared. <laughs> Can't want to even eat that much. Well, I witnessed it, so apparently. And I want you to know, before he ate all that, about two or three hours prior, he ate almost like a whole goddamn, like, piece of cheese. Like, you know, one of those, like, triangle slices. And, like, I don't know, 500, 600 grams of crisp bread. I would be hungry if that much McDonald's, too. That shit isn't feeling at all. If you say so. Uh, all I know is that Swedish McDonald's have, like, the absolute worst quality of food I've ever had. Anyways, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, it was terrifying, but I think we're ready for the game now. Now that we're all thinking about horrible food disorders. That's the only way I can imagine that, being a food disorder. Let's switch to the game screen. Oh no! Unauthorized reproduction of this- Oh no! Who would do such a thing? That's illegal, man. <laughs> oh man, look at these graphics. Sunsoft, this looks glorious! So good. Oh wow, laser noises. Woo! That's not part of the graphics. Jason the Athen Rye, resubscribe for one month to tier one, they've been subscribed for eight months. Amazing. 10 out of 10 graphics. Thank you so much for the sub. It's good to see you, Jason. I saw your Discord messages too. Spoiler alert, McDonald's is terrible everywhere. Actually, it's pretty okay in Japan. And in Germany, apparently. Unless my friends are lying to me. Three members of the occult club of a senior high school turned up missing while away on holiday. One of them, a girl called Linda, sent her mother some photographs before she disappeared. But the photos were no ordinary holiday snaps. Let's play music so loud you can't hear the narration. Good idea. When Linda's mother saw the photographs, she engaged the freelance occult reporter Akira to search for her daughter. Did you see a Sylvester Stallone lip? Oh, Kojima popped up and was like, hang on. <laughs> the children were last seen a country town in southern europe you see what i mean about the audio crackling it's a bit weird i'm, I'm not sure why it's doing that i messed with the settings a bit and it doesn't seem to be quite as bad now there he found the mansion <laughs> what a mansion uh you look 
Not scary, just weird. Weird mannequin. Metal mannequin. Alright. Welcome to the note. Why is new game in red? Whatever. Oh, I want to play this in French. No, we're going to do English. Sorry. There's McDonald's right next to where I live. I can't remember when the last time I ate there. Uh, although the U.S. there is even worse. The U.S. McDonald's is fucking terrible. Sweden, I think, is exactly like um, American McDonald's. Where you can tell that the beef isn't really beef and it's really thin. And by the way they cook it, it's, it just ends up like soggy and sloppy. It, mm. Bad. It was stereo. Oh no, I gotta adjust brightness. It's invisible. Yes. 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 Adjustment complete. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. It's so quiet. Sorry about yeah. that. No sign of anyone around. Yeah. It doesn't look like anyone has lived here for a long time. Oh. The building looks pretty old, too. What a mansion. What a smallest curtains. Do you think the kids were really here? No. If Linda sent photos of the place, they must have been. But whether they're still around or not is a different matter. I can't get those photos of the spirits out of my head. My mind. Me neither. I can't get well, those out of my head. Let's take a look around and see what we can find. Yeah, I think you're right. Also, this music. This is survival horror music. Kind of funky. These are such tiny curtains. What the? Wait, I look up and down with X and triangle? And I can strafe with square and... Oh god, these controls. Okay. How do I interact with things if I can't... R1? Wait, L1? Oh. I have a light source. Okay, how do I interact with things? I just walk into them? It is R1, okay. <laughs> Not going that way. <laughs> Execute! Operate! Wow, wow, whoa, okay, okay. Okay. It's one of those games. What? What? Item free. Watch. Antidote. Ointment. Match. Oil. Do I have all this? My goodness. Okay, so open. Okay, 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 okay. I get it. Record means set your buttons up. Okay. I get it. I get it. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I understand. Yeah. It's a broken clock. I can't close it. Locked. Yeah, he's blinking constantly. I can't do anything about that. It's too dark to do anything. Hmm. 
Nein. Ups. There we go. This game is weird. The music is like taking any creepiness out of it so far. Can I take this? Man, that looks so weird. 2D images, am I right? <laughs> it's too dark over here, huh? I guess it really is broken. Alright, let's try this. Let's see if it's real time. It is real time. Would Paul be taking it, I wonder? Use track of the time, neutralizes poison, use to heal wounds. Got five of each. Oh shit, I have limited matches. Okay. You gotta be careful. What does free do? Is that just free it up? Yeah, okay. Oh, erase. That's a thing? Can I just erase things? Delete. Delete that gun. Okay, whatever. I don't want to take the gun anyway. We have a small town hanging on the wall. It's too dark to see. Dude, you have a lantern. This thing. How do I take that? Okay, erase does what I think it did. Open it. Stand by. Okay, that's wait. Time is apparently a thing. So I can't take all these things, but no take. Okay. Rat! Oh god. Oh god, it's coming for me. Ah! Help! If only I had the gun on the wall! Giant enemy rat! Ah! Ah! Dangerous! Let's get out of here! Okay. My god, this darkness thing is gonna drive me nuts, isn't it? <laughs> Dude, I can clearly see it. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be one of those games. I don't know, the rat probably almost killed me. It's not like I can see my health or anything. Bat! Rats, wolves, and bats. I can't strafe and go forward at the same time. It's unlocked. Is this the front room? Yeah, okay. Okay. Survival horror! Open the... There we go. Not like it's nighttime. Indeed. Why can't you open it?
Hmm. Kind of surprised. This game is, uh... Uh... Game is less than I expected it to be. Okay, clearly I'm missing something here. What, what with there being, like, enemies, then I can't fight them. That's okay. How do I go upstairs? By looking up. Okay. Let there be light. I can't tell if they were trying to be ambitious with this game or not. Oh. It, yeah. Okay, so if there's something when I search, he will tell me. I don't have to do anything in particular. I get it. Is that the only... Yeah. Bash, you're in the way. What is this music, though? This is so inappropriate. Ow. Cheap hit. Close this. Run from the rat. Run from the bat. Wish I could turn faster. Looks like a dungeon door. Bathroom. Giant rat. Uh, run really jankily around. <laughs> you know, I gotta hand it to either. It controlled a lot better. Oh my God. Oh, so I can tell how much health I have by how much of the screen I can see. Okay. Being damaged gives me tunnel vision. Damn it. Ow. Ow. Ah! It's dangerous. Let's get out of here. I'm trying. Jesus. You know what? I think it's time. Oh, that did not heal very much. <laughs> oh. Okay. This game is hard. I hate you. I wanna... Yeah, thanks. Now I can take the gun, right? a gun. Take the gun. Goddamn right. Now I have the gun. The shotgun. Good times. It's used to attack enemies. I don't think the oil will work on the broken lantern, because, well, I don't know how the lantern is broken, to be fair. You can try. Is 
suddenly I have ammo. Alright, we're gonna show that rat who's boss. Actually, I should probably not do that, but now we can go back that way where the wolf was and hopefully get through there. I really wasn't expecting this music. This is really silly. It wasn't even like any like visual effects or anything. One dead wolf. Monster corpse. It's a wolf. With big red eyes. I guess the light won't always be here, considering this game is timed. Probably shouldn't open all of these, but you know what? I want to. Unusual to see visitors. Shotgun her. What brings you here? <laughs> I'm holding I'm it in my hand. People. I see. These children, actually. Actually. Have you seen them? Yes, I've seen them. <clears throat> really? Really? <laughs> Point the gun at her. I'd appreciate any information you can give me about them. I'd appreciate any information you can give me about them. Hmm. Doesn't like cutscenes. I don't mind telling you, but could you look for something for me too? <laughs> God, the voices. Da da da. Look for something. Go. Uh? It's about this size, a small red stone. The philosopher's stone. You'll if you see it, if you find that stone for me, I'll tell you what I know about the children. You live here. You should be able to tell. This is so stupidly weird. All right. I'll be waiting for you here at this time tomorrow. Oh. Don't forget. Don't forget. What an unpleasant person. <laughs> yeah. Yes, but it looks like we're getting closer. Yes. I guess. I guess. This time tomorrow, huh? What time is it? 3 p.m. That's it, I guess. Okay. Let's go look for a red stone. Into the dungeon! Oh, I see. Not quite what I was expecting. Yeah, okay. These guys could really have used, like... You know, you know how some people complain, myself included, in some games where it's like, oh... Why is one button doing everything? Like, Mass Effect 3 had that problem, where you take cover, vault over cover, run... ...a bunch of other, like, interact with things, all with a spacebar. This game could've used something like that, because, uh, having a menu with commands... Hmm. Why is it broken? Open it. Pull it. Turn it. Erase it. Damn it. How do I save? Can I leave? Oh. Oh! Suddenly it's wizardry! I wasn't expecting this. Also, wow, we are loaded with money. Are you, are you sure this is survival horror? I'm starting to think it's not. I feel like I've gotten myself into something bad. Again. 
Rope. Bomb. Lantern oil. You sell shotgun ammo here? I'll buy a few boxes, I guess. Come in handy. Make up for the ointment I used. No saleable items. This is an inn. Oh my god. It's like a weird hybrid between an RPG finger quote and a horror game. How bizarre. All right. I have a map. Oh, I do. Actually very handy as well. All right. Oh ho! Oh ho! You think you're so smart, huh, bat? Oh. Ah, I can't shoot the bat! It's dangerous. Flee! Let's get out of the here. bat is too strong! So much for having uh, ointments. Oh no. Yeah. There's a monster corpse. Because it's dead. We mean nothing. It's clearly a really old stone stove. Hmm? Guess I'm about the window. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, so we can't quite kill the bats. Go! Ow. In the way. It's like shoving me around. There we go. Oh, not the bathroom. Oh. Wait, what? It's a back door. Okay. Do I go back to the back door? No. Okay, I see how it is. I guess it does have like an exit over there. I should have realized. Oh, whatever. You got an emblem. I wonder. Metal, rather. Soul metal. Okay. Bathroom, yes. It was indeed a bathroom. I'm glad they happened to sell the ammunition I need. Oh, monsters respawn. Great. This is a weird game. Huh. This is locked. Oh, we got a lot of doors to open. Whoa. Just break it. Look at it. Useless. Hmm. It's too dark to see that barrel. I hate you again. That probably still isn't enough either. He's a little bitch. There's some firewood. Take the firewood? Yes. Hmm. Pr 
person in looking rooms. I don't know, I just look old to me. Oh. So it is an incinerator. Cool. I don't know why I did that, but let's hope there wasn't a girl hiding in there. Incinerator's on. Yay. Now what? I'm kind of pointless. Did I lose my wood? Yeah. The soul metal in there. Oh. And time passes quickly. What's the point of turning on the incinerator, I wonder? Can't do anything else in here. Out here, I should say. Well, that's the whole first floor look through. I guess we'll try the second floor. Oh, no, you don't. Worth the shot. Yeah, that'll do. I'm amazed that we can't hit the bat. Guess it's such a pain in the ass. Three locked doors, I think. I don't remember, so I'm gonna go check. Yeah. This guy gotta stop blinking so much. This is where we got the metal, right? Yeah. Okay. You only do one action at a time. I can't turn and look up and down. I can't turn and strafe, though. Feels a bit weird. This music. Ah! Can't hit the bat! Yeah, you just can't hit it. Go! Cheap hit. Game is gonna be one of those full of cheap hits, isn't it? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop trying. Well, I must have missed an item somewhere. I bet you something stupid. I'm gonna show you what, I, what I'm thinking. Also, let's check this one one more time. Another metal. Well, so far the game has taught me that sideboards have metals. And metals... Question mark. Ah, it's alive again! I don't even have to, like, leave for a long time to just respawn. And then grab some more firewood. I just want to see if the incinerator is still burning or if it's done burning now. Can I have more? 
Game's like, no, don't be greedy. Incinerated burning? Yeah. How am I hurt again already? Those bats are kicking my ass. God. It's not even touching me. What the? Weird. Yay. I bet you we can put the firewood here. That will be really awesome. Indeed. Well, cool. that was totally worthwhile. And now we'll put the metals in here. I'll put my watch in there. I don't know what the game expects of me, man. Right. I have no idea. At least the wolf is gone. Is there nothing out here? This is locked door. Troy is bright outside for being pitch black. This is where I met that lady. That creepy lady. I'm sorry to tell you, lady, but your house has, like, no furnishings. At all. Pretty sure, I should say. Am I bad at this game? I literally have no clue what, I, what I'm missing. I guess I just gotta search things and hope items pop out. <laughs> what do you mean nothing? It's missing hands. Oh god, no. Ah yeah, this room. Uh oh. Shit. Fairly normal purple fl purple flames. That is a big key. Whoops. I you look up. There's an altar. Is that where the... Oh. I think at least that wolf will be gone now. Are these both broken? There we go. Looking good. So that key. The key to the mansion. No, 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 no. What the? It's pushing me around again. 
This fucking bat! It's Stop! Let's get out of here. Oh my god! I'm stuck. It like kept pushing me into the corner. God dang, the bats are crazy. Oh, I'm just gonna go rest in the hotel. Uh, yeah, I can rest for a decent amount of time. Now it should be like two in the morning. I hear some music loop, but I don't think it's supposed to be there. Loading? I wanted to save. Maybe it's 2 p.m. Uh, yeah, there's definitely some weird sound issue. Oh, well. Try to key on the first floor first. So, what do you guys think of this mess? It's pretty great, right? Pretty chill. Okay. Oh, I wish I could run. Apparently we're playing another Prince Eric. Well, let's just head up the stairs, I guess. Unless this bat pushes me around again. It's too dark. Fuck you. Oh my god. Let's get out of here. I wonder if this is even too obscure for you. Maybe. Oh god. Oh god, stay away. Oh, I'm stuck. Light the thing. Ah. I hate you, game. There. Thank God. Go. Hey, look, a functional lock. Oh my God, this darkness thing is so fucking annoying. <laughs> it's too dark to see. Look at it. Can you take the thing? Oh, what's this? That's clearly not nothing. Ain't. I take this lamp. Why can I never take a portable light source with me? You think that would be the first thing you'd bring? There's a there's clearly a door behind this bookcase. Yeah, there's nothing here. Stupid game.
Game, there's obviously something there. Don't give me this shit. Is it gonna be something weird like, light the table lamp and it will move? No. I hate you when you're nothing. Set it on fire. Damn. Is this a hint? I don't know what it expects of me. What? It's a puzzle. And I don't know what it expects of me. Did I lose my key? I did. So I'm supposed to know how to solve this puzzle. But I don't. Uh, uh, uh. Well, you know, there's only so many combinations. We can try all of them. It's gonna take forever. Unfortunately, I kind of need all of these commands. I guess we can take the shotgun away for a bit. I hate the commands. I'm a commander, but this is ridiculous. Execute, erase, I know, right? I get the feeling none of this is actually doing anything. Yeah. Great. Game, you can clearly see there's something there, right? The fact that you're saying nothing makes me very frustrated. I hate you, game. Execute, operate, close. What do you mean there's nothing? Oops. It's very peculiar with how you use these commands. I actually don't like this very much. What's the significance of the paint? Can I pull it off? The painting, I mean. Erase the painting.
Close the painting. Open the painting. Shoot the painting. Damn it. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm quickly losing interest here. Very quickly losing interest in this game. We had a key. The whole first floor has been explored. And uh, all I have to show for it is this room we opened up where I can't seemingly do anything. Well, it would be kind of rude to end things, so let's just open up a guide, I guess. <sighs> it's gonna be a bit crackly because my computer don't like when I do other things. While the emulator is running. Bear with me. I miss Iru. <laughs> uh. Getting getting a lot of not this game, I think. Or is this the note? I guess this is the one. Apparently the actual name is Kokai Sarena Katashuki. The notes. But I guess that was too much, so in English they just named it the notes. <laughs> I think. The node uses a unique eyelid system to indicate Akira's health when he is injured. His health field of vision narrows. Yeah, that's unique and dumb. Game time. Certain puzzles requires particular timing, about 10 minutes of real time equals an hour of the game time. The one button action system is what they're calling this. I call it retarded. <laughs> Turn dials, pull levers, pushes switches buttons. Okay, so it's not for like pulling objects. Pushes to push switches. Pull is to pull levers. Turn is to turn dials. Okay. And erase is specifically for fires. And we have the actual guide, please. Okay. <laughs> Finding the redstone. Yep, yep, see the lady. Kill that annoying bat. Wait, how? How do, how do you kill the bat? What do you mean bats are easy to bypass? They kicked my ass. Okay, so you can supposedly kill the bats. Unique is one way of putting it, yeah. Maybe some other games that are not so great. It's in one hour, you can do a mixed stream with different games. I suppose I could. Um, Alright, you and me, bat. I forgot I took off my shotgun.
You know what? Okay, I got this. I got this. I'm gonna kill this bat if it's the last thing I do. You only have one HP, man. I think the game's lying to me. Let's get out of here. It's easy to bypass. How do you kill this thing? Oh. Like that, I guess. They only have one HP. So I just used like 12 shotgun rounds trying to hit this fucking thing. Wowza. What a game. I assume this thing won't respawn. Because uh, that thing's fucking dead. Oh god. Cheap hits. Yeah, I can do this. Yeah. Get dabbed on. Okay. Ah, the bat's dead. Okay. Action key. Okay. How? Okay. That's pretty counterintuitive. I want to show you how you solve the puzzle up there. I mean, it's kind of clever, but it's also, like, not. Your shotgun must be doing only 0 0.12 HP or damage. You'd think. Uh, but no, I just was aiming it bad, I guess. I, I was a fool to expect the shotgun to have some kind of, like, spread. Okay, so you remember this painting? I was like, do I have to shut the curtains? Yes, I was right, but... I also gotta erase this. Because when it's dark, supposedly... It's too dark to see anything. And it has to be dark. Burn to this guide. All right, that's why. There's still some light in here. And when it's perfectly dark, that uh, so one question. How? Secondly, why? When you come in, everything's turned off, except this is open. So you can't see that, right? But they, they like, trick you by putting a lantern here, like, oh, you gotta light the lantern. What a bitch. Anyways. Six, eight, four. All right, then. Let's hope I understand this right. Six. Eight. I hate that. Does that? 
for. Wow. I swear if this door was locked. <laughs> These wolves always start by looking into the wall. Well, I, I guess I found a red stone. Hey. Sealed, though. Well, it's just been waiting for, like, a full day, but I'm, I'm sure she'll still want this thing, right? I feel a bit bad. I wanted to show you guys a horror game. This is, this is not a horror game. The internet has lied to me. So let's, let's give her this thing. Uh, let's go save because I might want to mess with this off camera. And then we'll change the stream because, um, <laughs> this is, uh, <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Ah, it's so easy to bypass when they push you around. Jesus. I can't believe they say it's easy to bypass. Oh, they're super easy to bypass, and they push you around because they run three times your speed. And you get shoved into a corner, and your guy goes, ugh, 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 ugh. Like, it's like you're playing Doom or Wolfenstein, and you're just going around pushing spacebar against all the walls to find any, like, secrets, you know? So he goes, hm, 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 hm. Ah, sorry. <laughs> I get easily frustrated. Because there's, like, bad game design, and then there's this. <sighs> uh, it's making me sleepy. Alright, he'll make a save and go give her the stone, and we'll call it good for this fantastic game. Is this quite a horrific game? Yeah, just not in the right ways. Now, I have another horror game that I know for a fact is supposed to try and be a horror game. It's, it's really not, but at least it tries. Yeah, she's been waiting for a while. Um, there. I will say this. It's an ambitious game. But it, it's just... A little bit of a miss, you know? Just a tad. I've been waiting for like six days. What is this fucker? Um. Lady? I wonder what this stone is. Da -dai. It feels kind of like there's something throbbing inside it. <laughs> That's normal. Yeah. Almost as if it were alive. Oh, she should be here any minute. Oh. That sounds like her. Does it? Did you find the stone? Yes. Well, let me see it. Are you going to turn into a lich or something? This is the red stone you wanted. Isn't it? Isn't it? Tell the truth. Yes, this is it. Uh. Okay. Now tell us about the Wait, children. Wait, didn't you, did I give it to her? Why do I still have it? What's so funny? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay.
That uh, is that it? Hello. <laughs> Do not venture any further into our world, or it will be the end for you. I know. The rats are deadly. The children you are searching for are destined to die. Oh my god, I want to be famous. Can I buy you followers, primes, and viewers? Amount viewers? Hang on, let me write down that. Let me write down that link real quick. So they're alive. You could just kill me, lady. <laughs> and act as a bot. Too late. What the? Aaron, what are you doing here? Who are you? Me, I am Paolo. Sorry, I mean Paolo. I once lived in this mansion. And you are? There's some theme music. This is my partner, Angela. That's a lot of NFTs. What on earth was that creature? That was. See a neck on the in the toilet or something? Not on the toilet, in the toilet. That was Necromedia. Mistress of death. Never I'll do it. So she really does have power over life? Yes. She's one of a group of evil spirits I've been pursuing. Her soul stone disappeared from its hiding place. So I came to see what was happening. Sorry about that. But I see I was too late. Uh -huh. Her soul stone? Duh. Do you mean that red stone? Yes, the red stone you found. Yes, the red stone you found, idiot. The stone contains her soul. Yeah, we get that. It's called her soul stone. In order to protect themselves from external enemies, these evil spirits place their souls in other objects and then leave them in a safe place. That seems like a bad idea. I had hidden the red stone, but... It wasn't really hidden. I was in the middle of a room. We came and took it away. I'm so sorry. <laughs> We didn't realize what we were doing. Oh, men the say. Uh, don't worry. Eh, it's not your fault. I'll find it eventually if I keep searching. I should have put it in an open room like but that. What are you doing in this mansion anyway? Finding the girls who went missing here. Where have you we're been? Looking for some children. That didn't sound suspicious. Children? Yes. The one in this photo. It seems they're missing somewhere in this mansion. Do you know anything about it? That evil spirit seemed to know something, but I couldn't get any information out of her. I saw some children here once. I think they were the same ones. But if Necromedia is mixed up in it, you might as well give up hope now. They'll already be dead. Oh no. Those evil spirits use the spirits of living humans to nurture their soul stones. And to make new ones if they lose them. If you get involved in this any further, you'll be killed too. I know, the bats and rats are crazy. You should leave this place now while there's still time. Good idea. Forget about the children and go home. Okay, will do. But Necromedia said. It's Meta. Necromeda. Or Necromeda. The children you are searching for are destined to die. Soon. Destined to die soon. So they must still be alive. If they're destined to die, I don't think you can do anything. You think they're alive but in prison somewhere then? You think this pose looks makes me look like a butterfly? I think so. Dude. Do you know how we can find the evil spirits? This conversation is so dull. Yes, but Paulo, we must save those kids if they're still alive. Paulo? I, I have no emotion. In that case, Use this. What is this? 
What is it? It's the key to the cottage out back. Hmm. There's a room there that is connected to the spirit's castle. The what? But I warn you, if you go in there, there's no guarantee you'll come back alive. <gasps> Nani? I understand. Well, be careful. I miss resting in evil. What a strange man. That's okay, Anik. I handled it. I was a true profes professional about it. Well, Paula told us to go home and forget about the children, and I think he's right. Let's do that. Forget the children. We don't need them. Let's go home. Yay! All right. I don't have a pause screen, uh, so you're going to be witnessing the emulator logo for a little bit here. Well, actually, it breaks. So it doesn't really matter. Um, we're gonna be switching games. Hey, black screen. Nice. Um, cause that was bad. <laughs> that was actually so bad that it wasn't even fun to play in like a haha, this game is bad sort of way. It was just painful. Pretty painful. So, um, let's try something different, shall we? Thankfully, I have a backup plan. So give me just a moment while I actually extract this uh, from my official disc, of course. Wink, wink. You just go home and make some new children, all right? It's, it's, not, it's not really how that works. Um, for one, there's a whole consent thing, and, and, and then, you know, it won't be the same. It's also not their children to begin with, so it, it causes more problems than it solves, I think. Good idea, though. Good idea. I'm not panic pushing the panic button under my desk. Okay, let's let's try this game. Uh, it's gonna be a black screen for a little bit longer. Bear with me, please. Just a moment. Not play the note. Let's play this game, which looks really dumb. But that's what I like about it. Okay, doesn't look like I gotta reset the window or anything. This is a game. I should change the stream information, actually. Uh... Go... Ah, uh, what is my thing doing? <laughs> Hang on. Uh, there we go. Fun fact, um, Stuff is happening. Fun fact, um, when I entered the, the note in uh, the stream information, it, it actually had no idea what game it is. So it didn't have any, like, information on it like it usually does. No tags at all for the note. I kind of understand why, you know? Game level. Normal, I guess. So this is Resident Evil if it was action. So action evil. It features uh, Gunman McGun and not Jill with Tonfa guns. True story. This is also an English game, so we should have some beautiful voice acting, I'm sure. Okay. Yeah, not Jill. Oh god. That was a noise. <laughs> is everyone alive? Yikes. 
What the hell was that? <laughs> that was not okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, hmm. Okay, then. I think we found the creepiest part of that game. Uh, let's, 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 let's try that again with, uh, different audio. Yeah, I, I'm a headphone user, so I, I think, I think the emulator broke. I, I can't boot it up again. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it killed my emulator. <laughs> I think it actually killed the uh, process. Let's open up the resource manager. First jump scare, we're already deaf. Uh, pretty well. Yeah, the emulator is not running, uh, but I can't open it back up. There we go. It works now. Okay. <laughs> that was pretty awesome. I told it not to record my mouse, but it's still recording my mouse. Weird. Uh, let's try this driver instead. Yikes. That was crazy. Okay. I'm gonna try this again. Uh, bear with me. I'm going to mute the game audio. You guys won't hear anything right now, so don't worry about it. Uh, but if it sounds okay, I'm going to re-enable it. Made my internet go. Go down for a bit. <laughs> Eon! Oh, I didn't know you made games, Eon. Meow. Taito. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. Okay, it seems to be fine now. There's actually no music here at all. I changed the audio codec entirely. So yeah, we have Rick, who is Gunman the Gun. He's finding the Muse E-Launcher. Muse! And we have Not Jill, who uses Tonfa guns? Crazy. And by Not Jill, I mean Mitsuki, of course. It's very quiet. I can fix that, though. One moment. That's okay. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, any preference on character? Do we play Redhead Man or do we play Not Jill? Not Not Solid Snake or Not Jill? Jill uh, Valentine. Hmm. Rick? Wait, his name's not Mitsuki, it's Mituki. Ooh. The weird name. Maybe good for one's arm. I vote not Jill. Maybe good for one's arms holding and shooting SMGs like that. I don't know if they're SMGs, they almost look like. Can't tell if they're rifles or shotguns or. Whatever the fuck. Now she's repeatedly kicking. Gun, 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 gun. ABC. Uh, I think it's DEF. ABC, DEF. Ah! I got it! No, they're both deaf, apparently. <laughs> well, right, we're deaf now after hearing that bug, so I guess it makes sense. These shoes look weird. 
Like the inside of his shoes looked like they were split apart from each other, you know? Like originally his feet were like melted together, and then he split them apart. It's weird. I'm gonna do not shield because that then I can fool myself that it's Resident Evil. All right. Maybe it just means mounted gun. Oh, there's no voice acting. I'll go over the parameters of the operation. You'll be infiltrating Fluxus Biomaterial Industries Lab 7. Fluxus, huh? It's a civilian research facility. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. We sus suspect that the research is related to stolen parasitic tissue. Alright, no, there is sound. There's definitely sound. It's just very quiet. Hey, can you hear it now, Mr. Krabs? Infrared surveillance data indicates that the facility is now contaminated. Your mission is to check out the facility and retrieve the research data. Now, it's just background noise, like uh, computer noise at the moment, so there's not much to listen to. If a contamination accident has occurred, eliminate the cause at once. So kill the tyrant. I lost contact with the DEF agent who infiltrated the facility two days ago. Send in the ABCs. Be on your guard at all times. That is all. We will shortly be entering the airspace over the lab. I don't think we'll get another... <laughs> Roger. Because um, I changed the codec entirely. This one is less accurate, but at least it doesn't have that particular sound issue. No worries, I'm ready to throw off my earphones if need be. So we sent in these regular dudes in uniform and guns, and then we sent in this lady with, like, what, what are those shorts called again? I forget. And dual tonfa guns. Like, you could stand to have some leg protection, lady. It's okay. I thought the other sound was very accurate. I mean, it might have been. The interior of the facility is probably very well guarded indeed. I doubt it. Level 1 security activating. Security card required. How do we deactivate it? Maybe I should give it an Arnold voice or something. Or like a Butch voice. The quickest solution would be to shut down the control system. But we'll need to pa we'll need a pass card for that. Doesn't look like we're gonna have it easy. Oh, I get to choose. Let's go through the refrigerator. I'm kind of hungry, except I'm not. So there's actually an RPG I would love to play on stream. Because uh, I played it a ton during my childhood, and it's actually super good. But I don't know if that would be fitting with uh, <laughs> the, other, the, the other games I play. It's also a tactical game, so it's kind of like Tactics Ogre, but interesting and fast. Alright, I can control now. I got Napalm 3, I got Energy 200, and Life. Okay, I can kick, doesn't do anything else. I can shoot. Okay, Energy is consumed when I shoot. This is clearly not a machine gun. This is like a plasma gun. There's the Napalm, holy shit. That's pretty awesome. Ah, oh, I can... I can roll. Interesting. Reload? Which... Not sure what that does. We can do nothing. Ah, oh, we can center the camera. Well, these controls are pretty okay, actually. It's us now. 
Mm, B doesn't do anything. Look at this. <gasps> what do you think? Looks like a first stage parasitic infestation. But was there anything like this in the life form samples from last time? No, it wasn't reported. Looks like this job isn't going to go down easy like usual. What? What's this? Comes from Half-Life. It's an entry card to get into the control center. Looks like we can get in at least. Barry is investigating. Investigate better, Barry. Nani? I should stand still when the earth shakes so I can look around and see what's happening. Nigero! Oh, he's very dead. Turkey, hurry! Save yourself! Goodbye, loser. Jake! Wait, did you leave? Okay, I thought you leave left without him. Nothing we can do. No, wait. Nothing we can do. One mistake and we're all dead. Or was that the other guy? You were right. Still, that was something else. We hit it, and it didn't even blink. Well, you hit it. I was running. I also didn't have eyes. Is that what those cells grow into? Yeah. But there were no reports of life forms like this in the previous operation. You mean it's something else entirely? I don't know. It's very likely the biological manipulation was going on here. It's like Swedish trying to sound German, trying to sound Swedish. <laughs> I like it. Oh my god. Whoops. Well, I got him. <laughs> Kind of, kind of hit the wrong button there. Oh no. <laughs> okay. B is for searching stuff. There's nothing here. Sounds like your best Arnold voice. It's pretty bad. I, I don't do voices very well. Maybe I should give her a, a Nappa voice though. I love the way this defense man is running, by the way. Look at him. Is very well trained to run, um, very stilted. I mean, it's, I guess so am I, but... Man, you know, you know what would be a cool game? Dino Crisis. It's Resident Evil, but with, but with dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. I'll start by contacting headquarters. I'll check around. And he's gonna wind up dead. What's the shoot button? Okay. Robot! Now, let's reloading. Bastard. Nice. That does sound very cool. It's actually a good game. Um, last time I tried playing it, though, uh, I had issues with the audio sync for the conversations. It would just be very desynced. Otherwise, it was perfectly fine. I guess I don't have the level 2 card. Security is not being released. We must release the level 2 security. Must release the level 2 security.
I got a data disk. Cannot use this terminal. Ah, face huggers. I know you're there. Nice. Ah. Life pack. It's not a med kit, it's a life pack. I'm not a crazy Russian hacker, I'm a crazy Swedish uh, packer. You stop drinking. I don't I don't drink though. Ow. I'm getting hit by everything, but it's working out. That looks surprisingly like the uh, Swedish film logo. Here. Oh. Energy pack, nice. Ammunition, that did not refill it entirely. But clearly I gotta be a bit more careful than I have been. Fluxus database. Fluxes biomaterial industry. Well, so far this game is a lot more playable. I still wouldn't call it survival horror, but it's good so far. Wow. I recommend you keep a record of your movement so as not to waste the work you've done, especially before dangerous operations. Each area should have a terminal, a terminal for records. I left my drink in the meeting room. I'm sorry, but could you remove it when it's time to use it? It's a hard job to get there from here. Use what? Oh, the meeting room. Okay. That was the passcode for level 2 security. It's confusing when they keep changing it all the time. I wonder if it's something to do with that mouse. How's it going with the AP? Yesterday an infected rat was roaming around as well. You got people already infected too, haven't you? Be quick. Come on, that's enough. Are you going to stand by and watch us die? It's been two people this week. There's still time now. Do something now. Nothing in the trash. Oops. Is this noise? I see you there. I like that it's a different kick when it's a finisher. That's pretty neat. I think that's pretty cool. See, if that other game control like this, it would have been great. So what's on these data disks? That's nice, we got a map too. How do I... Go. Magazine. How do I switch between these? L and R. Ah. Dirty note paper. It says swarm. Okay. Does it say swarm? It says something else too. We have four data disks apparently. Auto adjust. Auto focus. Well, whatever. I don't know. I'd say this game is pretty all right.
Oh shit. Kick those robots. Ow. Okay, I can't roll through them like in Dark Souls. I keep trying it anyway, though. <laughs> Oh wow, that hurt a lot. And that roll isn't too useful. A little four door. That ain't happening. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of EDF actually, doesn't it? to do like face hug you nice 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 There's a lot of loot in here but again uh while this feels a lot better to play than the last game this is still not really a survival horror game Lux's database. The line is not connected. Oh. Also, security passcode can be entered from this terminal. Fix her head. But yeah, no, definitely a lot better than the last game. Again, not perfect or anything, but pretty cool. Is that a soda? Yeah. Nice. Women's bathroom. Hey, someone left a drink on the toilet. I want that. Toilet drink is my favorite. Yes. Yes. Toilet drink. Is this useful only between nine and three? Weird. Can't go down there. Door leads outside, it's shut tight. No, I wanted a disc. Whoa. Took a lot of kicks to defeat that one. Or drink. This guy gives you a lot of loot. Excuse me. But yeah, no, um, I've definitely played a lot worse. Oh. The camera is a little unhelpful, but that's okay. That's funny. I can't race outside. You can't what? Maybe it is damaged. You mean hail outside? Is that what you mean? Can reach outside? Slow motion. Oh my god. Look at all those monsters!
this. The same thing as the life form found at the accident two years ago. It resulted from the same cells, I'm certain of it. Larry, fix the communicator circuits. What are you going to do? I want to check out the research facility. Wait, are you going in there alone? Look at these muscles, don't worry, I know that I called you better than anyone. But... And besides, if we don't act now, it'll be too late! Get to the computer! I doubt you'll just stay in its tube, like a good boy! Okay... Our comps work within the building. I'll call when I know what's going on, or when I'm dying horribly. Also, my legs are fucking huge. Give my muscles. Watch yourself. I know! You take care of those repairs! This is a slow cutscene because my emulator is running slowly. Let's get the fuck out of here! Anyways, yeah, this place is fine. Um, like I said, it's, it's perfectly fine. But... It's not survival horror. It, it doesn't have that... Ridiculous, obscure... Feel that I want to show you guys, so... I don't know. You know, there's one game I've been quite interested in for a while. Uh, it will probably take me like two minutes to get it, though. But if you don't mind, we can go look at that real quick. I'm probably still gonna stream for another hour or so. In fact, let's do that. Let, let's let's do that. I think that will be fine. So, give me some time here. I'm going to... My mouse cursor. Oh, it's so fancy. Going to close this up and in give me like two minutes here. I'm gonna just get it real quick. You know, from my original disc that I definitely have. <clears throat> yes. Swooping is bad. Let's see here. I remember the name of it, so it should be pretty easy to find. Down to age. Here it is. Interesting, it has a European release. I'll do that one then. A bit bigger than I thought it would be. It will take, I think, three minutes. So, uh... Why don't we talk for three minutes? Or something. Let's do that. <laughs> so, I was actually really quite disappointed in, um... I don't have a wait screen, so we'll do the... We'll do the default screen. I was quite disappointed in, um... The first game I picked, because it was clunky, which normally is fine as long as the game is interesting. Um, but it was very uninteresting. And honestly, I couldn't really get into it. It was just so much menu action for everything. You can't search that without using the appropriate menu action. And you can't fire your gun without using the appropriate menu, menu action or sending it up on your gamepad. You can't use your items. 
can't search, you can't like light candles. You gotta put them all on your your, your limited four buttons on your controller. You look up and down using triangle and X, like what the flap? <laughs> Most other games solves that by using the shoulder buttons to look up and down, you know, like Echo Knight or Iru, or I think pretty much any first person PlayStation game. Yeah. Oh, what do you mean, blah blah? It had the something something button system or whatever the heck. <laughs> uh, 50 seconds remaining. Alright, so this game that we're playing now, I know for a fact is a horror game. I don't think it's particularly scary, but I guess we'll find out. It's much more in line with the games I've been playing recently, so it should be interesting. Um, it's like Eater, but much more well thought out, I think. Story-wise. Um, to put this game into perspective that we're going to play here in a little bit, it is one of those survival horror games where you're being chased by a monster. And this monster is the whole, it's the same one the whole game. But it's, it's like having Nemesis from Resident Evil after you. But it keeps mutating and getting more, like, powerful and scary as you go. I've never seen a playthrough of this. Uh, I've seen bits and pieces of it. And I think it takes place, like, in the underground of Tokyo or something like that. Like, it takes place in almost like a steampunky setting under the, the city. It's kind of interesting. A lot more interesting than the games we just played. There go, just put that there. Extract it. Thank God for fast internet, am I right? I think the best part is like if I get hungry after streaming, I can grab some leftover pizza I made the other day. Oh, so good. Yummy. The best part of a bit about being hungry is that you cook really delicious food, so you can just have delicious food when you're hungry. <laughs> this really useless rant has been brought to you by me, Commander Useless. <laughs> All right. Let's cut this awkward music here. And let's open up this game. It helps that it's not a huge file size. Pardon the mouse. Is it? There it is. Okie doke. Screen looks good. Screen looks good. I'm going to switch the information on stream. There we go. I think this is kind of a cold classic game, but I've never played it before. But yes, welcome to Hell Knight. It's a weird game. That was pretty loud. I'll turn this down a little bit. There we go. Hell Knight. It's going to be a weird title, ladies and gentlemen. Naomi. She looks older than she is. I guess in English, Naomi. And we have Ivanov. It looks like he's dangerous. You actually have party members in this. Kamiya, I remember this guy. He's an asshole. And you can choose who you want to bring with you, I believe. Apparently every companion has guns and shit. To 
took place in an ordinary subway, a subway accident that took the lives of 56 people. The number of survivors still remain unknown. You were involved in the accident, and what you see is a gruesome scene where blood and rubble lay scattered about. Lurking in the darkness, you feel the presence of something humble. Tokyo Mesh, a large scale underground, blah, 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 blah. You are the main character who wanders from the subway tracks and finds yourself in a Tokyo Mesh. You desperately, desperately search your way through the vast underground dungeon in an attempt to return to the surface under Tokyo Mesh in another world. What is the this metropolis and the menacing flow is the dark messiah? You do not have the means of offensive attack that is possible to run. It's a life, it's a death, an unimaginable horror is about to begin. Why is this so fast? <sighs> I think I got half of that. Yes, I am the one who will be the next Prince of Darkness. Whew! Alright. Did you get all that? Good. Let's push start. Sport. EOV. A shake is fine. Let's do this thing. Oh, that doesn't look good. Does that look like that? Yes, it does. Okay. <laughs> uh, we'll leave it there. <laughs> Don't think I can really fix that anyway. Oh god, please tell me you're gonna go away. The research f facility in Shigaya. I should probably try and fix that, actually. Alright, hang on. Uh, nothing's ever easy. Nothing's ever easy. Everything always sucks. Alright, how do we fix this? Don't actually know. Try that, I guess. And yeah, why not? <laughs> I only have one uh, graphic drive. Well, no, I got the default one too, but that one has issues. All right, well, we'll, we'll give that a try. That looks better. Something, something dark horror, something subway, something run around. Yes, you got it. Well done. Now, the cutscenes might be a bit bugged. Oh no, unauthorized reproduction. Oh, shit. Wait, this is a Konami game? Oh, I had no idea. Okay, yeah, it's still buggy. <laughs> I, I guess the cutscenes will be a bit buggy, I apologize. Oh, I apparently skipped the whole story. Hmm. Well, I guess it's time for another reset. <sighs> well, why do things never work out when I try them? See, this is why I usually try games beforehand to make sure they run properly. So we don't, you know, have this issue. Well, let's try the official GPU core. We'll see if that will run okay. Let's hope this doesn't run at 600 miles per hour. It might do that with this core. Which will make it look hilarious, but I hope it runs okay. Please don't run too fast. Please don't run too fast. Okay, I think it runs okay, actually. Yeah, I think this might be fine. And I don't think it has the graphical glitches, so we'll, we'll use the standard graphic core. Let's go back to killing bats and closing curtains. No, let's not. <laughs> let's not do that. Okay. It works fine now. Sorry about that. Let's finally get this 
Show started. Research facility in Chikaya. I think this actually runs better. God is a demon fetus. A second laboratory for special research. 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 Oh no! I love the stock scream. That's good. Here's us, I believe. Well, not yet. The underground cutscene runs. Oh. Well, there. Game over. Well, game over for that lady. A cult which is called Holy Ring. Series of missing incidences. Those two things are getting people's attention these days. Or getting. It looks like getting. Tokyo! So people have been dying. Acolyte 1. Repent all, your world is coming to an end! It has been foretold that your world will end within the millennium. With the millennium. All shall be cast down and disappear into darkness. I'm slowly turning more evil. Again, those guys. There he is. That way. This makes no sense. I like it, though. Damn it, they got on the subway! How will we chase him now? Everyone looks so happy. How happy they are. I see a Japanese schoolgirl on that subway. That's not safe. Why why are they kept following me? This translation is awful good. Dude, there's no way the train would stop. It goes so fast, it would just slam right into that thing. Without hitting any brakes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Eek! Gasp! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to scream at you, I was just scared. What's going on? I mean, there was that horrible noise, and then the train fell over. What? Oh, wait. What's happening? Eek! Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Running on the track is not safe. Help us, please! Don't move, put your hands behind your head and drop your knees. What? What's going on? Where'd you two come from? Where did you- where did we go? And I don't have time to read all that. Eek! Why didn't you voice act this instead of having- Holy! Hurry, come on! I think she's like, got a child with her or something. On the train. There we are. Okay, this is running way too fast. I think. Maybe not. It's still coming! Isn't there any way to get away from it? What are you standing around for? We've got to hurry! Ooh, crowbar. It's a crowbar. It might come in handy. You found crowbar? Floorboards. It's locked with a padlock. There's probably something important behind it. What if we can't get this open somehow? 
They used their crowbar to smash the lock. Well, break it, I guess. I don't know about smashing it. That's not how you use a crowbar. A flight of stairs leads down into the darkness. It's, there's a jumble of iron plates and equipment stacked up inside. There's something in here. It's a compass! I'm glad I looked. Missing this seems to have probably have been a big mistake. Yeah, it seems safe. I guess there's only one way to go. Down. That eek, though. Eek! Let's hurry! If we hang around for too long, that thing will find us. A nemesis. You wanna save? Yes. Live in game, do not remove memory card. Beep, 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 beep. Save completed. Want to save? No. <laughs> there we are. Underground sewer. What's that smell? You must be in a sewer or something. We could just find some stairs or something to get back up to the surface. What, what was that thing chasing us? And those soldiers, what were they going to do with us? Don't ask. I'm sorry, you probably don't know any more than I do, right? Um, my name's Naomi Su Sugiura. Su Sugiura. Yeah, it's hard to say. Sugiura. Sugiura. I was out with some friends and we lost track of time. And then this happened. I don't know. It's all like something out of a nightmare, you know? It's like a... Hell of a night, you know? We got to find a way back up to the surface. Now I can control. Okay. Let's go north. Oh, I can run. Prince Eric! We are not Prince Eric. Hey. What's this? It's got this weird looking mark on it. Kind of creepy if you ask me. Cool. This mark? What's it supposed to be? I don't like this. It frightens me somehow. I guess I was on the uh, the subway, so I'm playing me. I'm useless. Useless and Naomi. BFFs. We're in a sewer, right? Yeah. Okay, so we can push square to talk to our party. Why did this have to happen to me? <laughs> what about me, lady? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop whining. Stop whining. <gasps> Wait a minute. We've got to get out of here. It's coming. It's coming after us. It's behind us. Huh? Whoa. <laughs> That's not behind. You lie. You lie to me. How fast are you? Oh, oh, God. I don't want to die. I don't want to die in a place like this. Oh god, you're way faster than I thought you were. Okay. <laughs> He's an actual threat. Got it. Oh shit. Wait. <laughs> she took the hit for me. She's dead. Oh god. <laughs> I got a character killed immediately. I didn't know that could happen. Holy shit. Oh, I'm getting tired. Okay. Well, we didn't need Naomi anyway, right? You're all alone now. <laughs> I like this one. That's pretty good. Hey, it's a fire extinguisher there. Oh, I have a map! Oh shit. That's awesome. Oh, I can look behind me. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh shit, is he behind me? 
ending. I don't think I'll make it that far. Maybe if we hide in here, it won't find us. The game doesn't even expect you to lose your party member this fast. <laughs> oh, God. What have I done? You know, it'll be better hiding if you close the door. I just hope this works. Oh, he was actually still out there. That's purple blood, buddy. I don't think it worked. Did it find us? You mean me? Just me. <laughs> uh, I kind of want to load. I, I, <laughs> I don't know if I'm comfortable losing that lady that quickly. Or we could just leave it be and, uh, you know, next time we'll actually start this game for real. Because uh, this is pretty cool. Did it work? Really? Interesting, I can talk to myself. What happens if he catches me? It's actually interesting that it's not like... It doesn't know where I am unless it looks at me. Is this the end? Oh. Hey. How you doing? Slap. Okay. Okay. Um... This is, uh, the best game we- Oh, wow, it just <laughs> puts you back in the main menu. This is probably the best game we played so far today. And you know what? It's an actual horror game. An actual horror game. So, uh, cool. Alright, now that I know that he's actually extremely dangerous, let's, um... Let's do better. There's actually a nice, like, actual bit feeling of dread when you play. Uh. Okay, it's a loading screen. There's, yeah, there's actually, like, a little bit of dread. Because he is scary, so to speak. I wish I could use save states, because, uh, this takes a long time. I think what I'll do is enter the BIOS settings and disable the function keys, so I can just use the F keys as normal. Or the FN key. You know, my, my computer doesn't have an FN lock. Yeah, you're always scared. It's not like I got you killed or anything. Oh, wait. Yes, I did. What if I don't go that way first? What if I go this way? Fine. Wait a minute, we gotta get out of here. It's coming behind us. Huh? Liar. Okay, and it's not fucking around. Go, 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 go. Okay, I think we made it. Nice. 
If you're hiding here, it won't find us. It sure stinks down here, doesn't it? It's kind of cold, too. We got other problems, lady. Just hope this works. Watch, there's some RNG to it. It's not gonna work this time. They find us? He really is like a tyrant or nemesis from uh, Resident Evil, isn't it? No, it's not. No, we're fine. Don't worry about it. No. Keeps chasing us and chasing us. Will I never give up? Probably not. Remember, useless. Don't get too close. He gets mad if you get too close. I do wish it would pick up the pace a little bit. He is somewhat better made than that, and Nemesis was always following you even when you should have lost him. True that. This guy doesn't seem to always know where you are, which is pretty cool. It's fine, Naomi. Let's hope that iron card we have helps us get through here. I cannot do anything with this. I love this rear view that you can turn on though. That's really neat. <laughs> I like how the dialogue is like, it's in chase mode, even though it's not chasing us. Only problem is, it seems to be in real time, so you gotta be careful. You gotta be slow. Slow and methodical. Wow, it puts him on the map too! That seems broken. Like, broken good. That's actually pretty awesome. Huh, this game is, this game is pretty good. Really nothing I can do here? There we go. Oh. No, I want to push it. I guess I'll pull it. Pull the switch. Not here, right? I don't know where it is now. I can also strafe. I don't think I want to touch that. Ouch! The cable's fallen into the water and it's leaking current. I won't be able to go any further this way. We got to get out of the water. Maybe if we can find the circuit breaker, we could shut off the current. Sorry about that, Naomi. <laughs> What's that thing chasing us? What's it doing here? I don't know, man. In my rubber band. Thankfully, it makes a lot of noise, so I think we'll know when it's coming. Maintenance room. It's light coating of dust on everything. Looks like nothing's been running for a while. The smell of oil is heavy in the air. Hmm? The pipes are flecked with brownish stains here and there. It looks like it's blood! What happened in here? I think I can imagine what happened in here. Nothing else in here. Uh, 
Not behind me, am I? <laughs> Not behind me, are you? Uh, why is it red in front of me? Oh no, that's the door behind me. Okay. <laughs> living things are pulsating. Non-living things are just... flat. Wait! There, around the corner! It's waiting for us. It's holding its breath, waiting for us to come so it can surprise us. She's right, damn. Oh, well, thanks for the heads up, lady. At least it makes noise. You can kind of tell. Where it is. Oh, except when it, when it doesn't hold its breath, I guess. A key holder. It's locked! I wonder where the key is. What? I don't think that was the right dialogue. Looks like there are no more locks. Do you mean keys? The translation's a bit wonky. But the game itself is pretty cool. I dig this. There's a dead end. Not, not great. Hmm, why do I use this key? Has he moved away from this? Or is he still holding his breath? I can be able to translation. Hey, it's moving this way. Let's see where he goes, if he goes straight down. I need to get past him, though, I think. I could backtrack a bit and see... Because he was, he was blocking the path earlier, right? We had to turn around and run from him. So maybe over there. I'm gonna try not to run, because... If you run and end up no, having no stamina when he pops in from somewhere, that's probably not good. I really like this idea of having to navigate... A maze and solve puzzles while there's this monster chasing you. And on top of that, I'm actually really uh, fond of the fact that if you have party members, they will take the hits for you so you can survive, but then they are dead, like permanently dead. I think that's cool. This is a pretty well, well designed game. I just wish the translation wasn't so shit. <laughs> I'm opening the map re religiously, but... I think I have to go further back. You really don't want to run into it in a dead end though, do you? Yeah, no, this is right. Then we take the left. I think I might know where we have to go, anyway, if this is not correct. But yeah, dang, having save states here would be quite nice. If this game is not kind.
This is where I started. I am right. I have a map, but I'm still getting lost. I have true talent. <laughs> Okay, I see where I see what I did wrong. Go this way. That just leads to a dead end. Okay, well, whatever. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with my my first thought of what we're supposed to do. Yes, I get the feeling a bunch of the stuff here is not just set dressing. I feel like a bunch of this actually matters, and there was one thing I saw that I wanted to look at, namely this thing here. This might be a circuit breaker, right? Kind of looks like it means something. But I can't use items here. Oh, um. I didn't really want to. We've got to find a way to stop the electricity. Oh, so you can remind you. I mean, this thing is so, like. Point it out, but I can't look down. I don't think. Uh, oh. If you hold R2, you can uh, move the camera around. Interesting. Whoa. Still can't grab any of this, though, oddly enough. I guess we just have to get past him somehow. Somehow being the key word. Let's hope he's still not patrolling that corner. But he's gotta be, because he's not anywhere else. Hello? He's moved. Use the small key. <laughs> that didn't make any noise. You can hear a low humming sound as if a generator is running nearby somewhere. Maybe we can shut off the power from in here. I bet there's a switch or something around here somewhere. Oh, there's a switchboard. Oh. I didn't want to pull something random. Oh, that's the only option I have. Okay. Yeah, won't move, it's broken. Like my psyche. He's moved again. Because he's not making noise anymore. Oh, is this a circle? Ah. Uh, so they give you... some ways to circumvent him chasing you. That's That's pretty nice. As long as you know where he is, anyway. So, I think he moves to specific locations based on your progress. He was guarding where we need to go now, and now he's probably guarding another location. Makes sense, right?
Where are you at? The left. Ah, he's going that way. He's going away. There's a lot of heavy breathing in this video, am I right? If he doesn't turn the corner, we'll just run. Oh, I wasn't complaining. Uh, I think it's actually pretty well designed so far. There's no point in having a monster that knows exactly where we are at all times, or, like, does not get in the way. I'm being extra careful here. Okay. I don't have to worry about him too much now. Be pretty far up behind us. I wish the translation was better. Oh. Large pile of junk blocking the pathway. It's a gap that looks like it might be big enough to squeeze through. Can't see what's on the other side. You want to go through the gap? Not yet. Making sure he's not standing right behind me. Okay, it's a dead end. All right, through the gap we go. Those games have the baddies rubber band behind you all the time. Yeah, it's pretty dumb. Yes, let's go through the gap. Welcome to the Tokyo Mesh! Yeah. Do you come from up above? My name's Razo. Everyone calls me that because I'm so small. Uh, okay. This is a Tokyo totally different from the one you know. It's a dark Tokyo, underneath the real one. Since it's all linked together like a fence, we call it the Mesh. I've heard it was a secret base for the Imperial Army. The underground headquarters. But I didn't really know, it's kind of a weird place. But home is where you hang your hat, right? Hey, what's the hurry? Why don't you take your time? Enjoy the sights. What? You want to leave right away? <laughs> You're welcome to try. I hate those cutscenes, though. They, they are not good. Let's save. And I think because of how long it's been, actually, we should call it here. But... I think this was a pretty good showing of this uh, kind of quirky, but interesting game. I like it so far. I'm actually surprised I haven't played it yet, because uh, I've, been, I've seen it a number of times, and I thought, eh, you know, it, eh. it doesn't look that good. I guess, though, t t tonight I have... Um, I have a fresh set of eyes, because... Uh, Playing those really bad games, especially The Note, uh, this is like 10 times better, or 100 times better, in general. So this was cool. Yeah, I like this. This was very nice. But friends... But friends, I think... <laughs> I think we'll stop there for now. How about that? But, I hope you enjoy the whole ride anyway, although, for me, it was especially fun once we got to uh, the last couple of games. Enek, that was fun. Uh, blah blah, this is a good one, although we have lowered our standards a bit after the note. Yes. Yes, I agree. A wild ride, but fun to watch. Thank you. Um, I'm sorry we didn't stick to any one game. I really thought the note would be more like Hell Knight ended up being. Uh, which is why I was excited to get that started. I was like, oh, another first-person horror game. It's gonna be great. And it's like, here's this weird unfitting music, this ridiculous control scheme, this really bad voice acting. It's like, ah, no, no, oh, it's bad. <laughs> so this was a pleasant surprise.
a lot better than I thought it would be. It's actually kind of terrifying um, when she was like, he's behind us, and we looked behind him, like, oh, he's going to pop in through the corner, right? And then he fell down from the top. I had a, like, small jump scare there. The monster itself isn't any, like, terrifying or anything, but I, I do love his, um, his sprint and his, like... I love how he makes noise, so you can tell he's there. And while it does give you a compass, which is very handy, uh, the fact that it gives you a map is even better, so it's just well designed all around, I think. The button uh, inputs make sense. It's good. I uh, kind of like trying some unknown games and getting your initial reaction to each one. <laughs> I think I used to do that before I played, like, retro games uh, completely, right? I, I was like, let's play some retro games, and it was just a bunch of weird shit. <laughs> like, um... Do you guys remember La Place Noma, which was like the SNES horror game where you go into a mansion and you, you you build a party of like detectives and scientists and stuff? That's pretty cool too. But I digress. Hell Knight, yeah, I like Hell Knight. I think I might have to start over next time I play it because I would hate for people on YouTube to see this stream. <laughs> as the introduction to Hell Knight. <laughs> so I might I might do like uh I don't know, I might record uh, the first part up to this point and upload that and then do the streams for the follow-ups. I think that I think that will make the most sense. Or I could just upload it and then cut off everything except Hell Knight. Yeah, I might do that. Yeah, that that's not a bad idea. Hell Knight after we fix the uh graphical issues. Anyways, guys, I know it's only been like two and a half hours, but um, it's getting late. Tomorrow, though, it is uh, Sunday. That's nice. We don't have to. We don't have to get a bit early. Yeah. I am. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I think my fiance wakes up soon, so I should give her a call. Dude, YouTube audience can't miss the note. It was gold. Was it gold though? I guess it was about fifty thousand gold, actually. Oh well, whatever. Maybe gold-plated shit. Yeah. Or shit-plated gold, I, I can't tell. <laughs> just, just lump in the graphical glitch portion with the rest of the VOD. Yeah, eh, I might. I mean, it is very typical of my streams, isn't it? There's always something that goes wrong. Should I also include, like, the super loud noise made by... <laughs> made by uh, Chaos Break? Hey, you know what? I just realized the, the, the Chaos Break sound was really fitting with the name of the game. It was chaotic and I broke. Thank you, the fixed version for a separate one. <laughs> That's not nice. <sighs> That's way too much work. Excuse me. I guess I'm kind of sleepy. Anyways, guys, as always, thank you so much for joining me tonight. It's always nice to have you here. And uh, I feel a little bit guilty for showing you these really crappy kind of shitty games, except for the last two, which are pretty decent. Next time, I think we'll continue Hell Knight and see if we can actually finish that game. I don't know how long it is, but uh, it's probably fairly long. That's fine, though. As always, be good to each other. Take care. I'll see you next time. Good night.